Making dashed lines in Adobe Illustrator. Okay, check this out. We're going to uh, make some dashed lines here. I'm going to switch this here to just be a stroke. And I'm going to go over here, bump it up. Now, you have your stroke, you have your stroke uh, palette. If you can't find that, it's here. You just go to Window and pull down to uh, Stroke. And you're going to go to the Stroke section. If this is hidden, you will see that just is the only thing you see. So you want to hit, pull out the little fly out and hit show options. And now, boom, you got this whole dash line here and some caps. I'll show you that stuff. Dash line, there you go. But you might want to change the spacing in it because this is, has a 12 dash, 12 uh, gap. Let's just change the gap to six. Boom. See that? Now you got a 12 uh, point line and a six uh, point gap. And then you can go here and let's go, uh, you know, let's just show you, like, or, you know, little tiny ones. If you want, you can go huge. Just go big or go home, you know. Mm. Or, um, see that? So you can you can really play with these. Uh, that's, and you can, you can even make them real weirder. Um, you know, let's go 12 on that dash. You know, see that? It's starting to break them all up. And then the next gap is going to be, uh, 20 so you can see that they, they get weird you can do whatever you want to them really it's customizable yeah but this is a bigger one too because I, I learned this actually for making stitching uh, in tech packs for clothing and whatnot and this is an important one this cap applies to the dashes too so you can go like that see that you got a little round guy now as as opposed to the uh, the square which adds you know depending on what you're doing it could add a little bit of a realism or just this looks better but uh, that's uh, basically the gist of of uh, dash lines really uh, straightforward as long as you know where to click so I hope that helped you out have a good day